Welcome back guys. Hey, we're on the uh, home stretch with the entree. So we'll go grab, grab that out of the oven. Doesn't that look great? God, it looks really good. All right, so as you can see, the radishes are in there, the garlic cloves are in there. Uh, I put it in for the requisite 25 minutes, I pulled it out, and then I added the, uh, the radishes and the garlic, put it in for the other 15 minutes that it says on the recipe. Now, I did take the liberty of putting this into a 425 convection oven. Um, if you have that capability, I suggest you do it. If not, then just put it at 450. So let's get that dished up onto the platter. Now you maybe can hear this. I've got I've got the burner going, and I'll, I'll tell you why in a second. But let's let's get this food out. We'll put it onto the uh, the platter. Okay. This looks great. This smells great. We haven't even put really all the herbs on there yet. Ah. I'm getting excited. A nice color on the vegetables, nice color on the potatoes. Nothing's terribly overdone, nothing's underdone. Oh my god, I didn't realize I was this good. This talented. But maybe I, I should have known that all along. So, like I said, I've got the uh, the pan on the, on, the, on the burner right now. I took liberty of earlier, taking care of some of that extra oil that was in the pan. So we want to put some chicken stock that I had some of the herbs kind of simmering in with. We'll do that. And to... Just enriching this a little bit more, we're going to take a little bit of butter. We're going to mound this up a little bit. Give the sauce a little extra consistency, a little better texture. High. You don't have to do this, you can just take a little bit of stock, deglaze the pan. That stuff on the bottom is called the fond or the foundation. It really is going to give an extra boost of flavor. Pour that over the chicken and the vegetables. All right, well, that looks good, really, really good. Okay, and then so, take a little bit of lemon over the top of the chicken, over the top of the vegetables, and some of the herbs that you chopped up, the rosemary, parsley, thyme, etc. Wow, that looks great. Oh my goodness. All right, looking fantastic. That's our finished dish right there. Uh, again, two people easily, maybe four people. Uh, I'm excited. Uh, our next video is gonna highlight the dessert and we'll be back in a while to do that for you.